Good morning YouTube, welcome back. Today is November the 1st and I will be 10 weeks pregnant tomorrow. I am doing this a day early because I go back to work tomorrow. Um, this has been a pretty good week. I am still smooth sailing, no nausea, um, still absolutely exhausted, but it does feel a little bit better than last week. I um, have my biggest change I've noticed is my jeans. <laughs> They're no longer fitting. Um, I can't do up that bottom, that my button mostly, um, has been my biggest problem. It's just that really low in the abdomen. Um, I can feel my muscles aren't this way anymore, they're this way now. So for the first half of the week, I was doing this with my jeans, hooking the button around, an elastic band through my button, uh, through the buttonhole, and back around the button giving me a few more inches and still being able to do up the fly so that it would do this. So that was how I first spent the first half of my week and it is for the most part what I'm still doing with my jeans. Um, my work pants all still fit. Um, I've got a few dress pants that still work just fine. Um, but I did go shopping with my mom and I bought my first pair of maternity jeans. They're actually really comfortable. Um, I went to Time Maternity just in one of the local malls and picked them up. They're a style of jean that I would probably wear anyway. They've got a cute little design on the back pockets. Um, I'm finding that they're maybe a little bit loose. They're um, giving out a size maybe by the end of the day. Um, jeans just kind of do that in general. It maybe should have gone down a size but they didn't have mediums. Um, in this style and I really like this style. So that's been fun. Um, <laughs> shirts are all still fine. I don't really wear too many like tight tight fitting shirts and if I do um, just wear a sweater or something over top. It's getting to a bit cooler outside. Um, it's been raining a bit on and off the last couple of weeks. So a sweater or a scarf has done me great just to cover up anything else. Um, so, I did pick up a couple of shirts, but I'm not going to need them yet. And I still like my old clothes. <laughs> um, the rest of this week has been pretty good. Um, I have been going through oatmeal like crazy now. Last time I talked to you, I think it was all dry cereal. And now I am making oatmeal every day. I love raisins and walnuts in it. And it feels really a bit more healthy and I'm so enjoying it. It's just, maybe it's the fall and just the way I'm feeling, um, but it feels like I'm giving myself a great start to the day. Um, so yeah, lots of oatmeal and I've kind of just been tweaking my recipes as the day's gone on or the week's gone on, um, putting more and more little things into it and kind of sprucing it up a bit. So yeah, I'm really, really enjoying that. Other than that, not really too bad for cravings. Um, I would say having a hard time going out for coffee with girlfriends on um, my days off um, that don't know yet. Of course, I'm ordering decaf coffee and going for the healthy alternatives and she's like, what the heck? I was like, oh, I already had my coffee today, no big deal. Um, but I am noticing that I am missing my coffee in the morning when I do have a decaf. It's like, mm, this is so delicious. And just chocolate in general. It's Halloween and I'm not eating chocolate and it just <laughs> it feels wrong. Um, so we only bought um, the Twizzlers and Nibs and licorice kind of stuff to hand out so that I didn't have the extra chocolate in the house because I'm not really one that stops once I start. I will... Uh, I'm bad with portioning size when it comes to chocolate. I just want to eat until I'm comfortable with chocolate. So I don't want to go there. So um, that has been a little more difficult, but all in all, not too, too bad. Yeah, other than that, I've had a really good, quiet week. I did meet up with Nikki and went for lunch and that was really nice to see her again. We um, live in two separate towns pretty far away and we meet up in one of the towns in the middle um, to see each other most of the time so I it was really great to see her again and have lunch and that would probably be one of my highlights of the day that and I've just um, Brad hasn't been that busy so we've been able to hang out a bit more 
um, gone for a couple of walks. Oh, I guess one other thing that I did do this week, um, went for um, the preliminary blood work um, at the beginning. Um, I guess it's just something routine they do on everybody, um, checking for any transmittable diseases as well as checking for antibodies um, against the baby. So I haven't gotten any results from that. It's just two days ago and my next appointment is until November the 14th. So my guess is I'm not going to hear anything until the appointment unless something's wrong. So hopefully I hear nothing. <laughs> so I think that wraps it up for today. Um, I hope you're enjoying these videos. If you are, please hit the like button. And if you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel for more DIYs and pregnancy vlogs. Thanks, YouTube.